you getting tired? Well, some is. Why don't you quit? I think it's done. We're setting a record. That's important. Right. Put an umbrella over him when the rainy season starts. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I got a great idea. We can hitch up a drill to the teeter-totter, and you'll be an oil well. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead and laugh. We'll show you. Yeah, we'll show you. Wait till I find out we're having spaghetti and meatballs. That'll get him in here. <laughs> And next week, you're going to go for the pogo stick contest. Yeah. <laughs> Hi there. Is this the Brady House? Yeah, it is. Can I help you? My name's Winters, Daily Chronicle. Hi, I'm Bobby Brady. And I'm Cindy Brady. Oh, you're just who I'm looking for. Your mom and dad are around? Yeah, they're inside. What's this all about, Mr. Winters? Just covering a little news story, son. Cindy and Bobby are news? Sure, they're out to set a world's record. Would one of you mind calling your mother and father? Uh, yeah, Peter, go get them. How long have you kids been at it? Since three minutes after eight this morning. Well, that's a pretty good start. Mmm. Oh, smell like that could drive a man mad. Well, I just may nab a little behind my ears. <laughs> oh, Dad, come on up. There's some guys out here from the newspaper. They're taking pictures and everything. Look, one hand. <laughs> You better be careful, young man. You know, this is a pretty big ambition, setting a world's record. We can do it. Do you think you can do this, young lady? Well, if Bobby does it, I do. We go up and down together. <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Brady? Yes? I'm Art Winters from the Daily Chronicle. Hello. Hello. I hope you won't mind us taking a few pictures of the children. No, you mean this is news? Sure. Great human interest stuff. We have a lot of human interest around here. My brother and I just fixed my sister's radio. That's fine, son, but one story at a time. I'm sure you're very proud of the two kids, Mrs. Brady. Well, to tell you the truth... Mother, very proud. <laughs> I guess you're a little concerned, too. Well, uh, my husband and I, at first, we thought that... Mother, all family concerned. <laughs> Mr. Winters. I know just how you feel. You do? Thanks a lot, folks. Oh, good. Goodbye, kids. Good luck. Uh, Mr. Winters, uh, would you mind telling me how you found out about this? We got a phone call down at the paper. First thing this morning. Oh, thanks. <laughs> I wonder who called the paper this morning. We did. We figured the people ought to know about it. Yeah, even us little kids can do something important. Important? So that's what this is all about. Spaghetti and meatballs is ready. Salsa squisita a la Alice. <laughs> Boy, are you guys missing something good? Spaghetti and meatballs. They're not missing a thing. I'm going to fix them something special, too. How come they get that kind of service? Well, because they're setting a record, and we don't want to spoil it, do we? Thanks, Mom. Thanks. Dad, why is setting a record such a big deal to them? Well... I guess Cindy said it best. Little kids can do something important. And sometimes we all forget that. Well, you know, kids want to be part of things, too. And, well, I'm afraid sometimes we give them the brush off. Like maybe trying to help fix a radio? Or like that time we painted the chair? Well, I guess we all understand now. Well, you got to admit, Bobby and Cindy really made their point. Yeah, but I'm afraid no matter how hard they try to break that record, one thing is bound to stop them. Uh. 